I'm Melissa, this is Martin, Haley, and Maddie, and we're cruising America's Great Loop on our boat, Cavalier. We welcome you to hop aboard and share in this journey with us. All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Cavalier. Um, this is our about our second week update, and cheers, baby. Cheers. <laughs> So, uh, but when we last left you, we were in, in Demopolis, and our plans were to get up and, uh, and start heading down the uh, rivers again. Um, but the problem was it started getting colder and even more cold. And it was the prospect of getting up at, at first thing in the morning and going through a lock when it was 14 degrees out just didn't didn't uh, appeal to us at all. So we decided to go ahead and stay at, at, at uh, Kingfisher Marina here in Demopolis, and we actually uh, stayed through Christmas. So we had our Christmas in Demopolis, and it was really nice. We, are, we were able to we able to use a courtesy car and go get some uh, f food to make a really nice dinner and, and uh, just enjoy the enjoy the holiday. And even though it was still pretty cold, but we were able to. It was enjoy nice it. and warm in here. It was nice and warm in here. We had our tree set up, and we had uh, the outside of the boat decorated, and some other decorations around Melissa had. So that was pretty fun. The dogs got some toys for yeah, Christmas, well, of course. Yeah, the dogs got their crazy opening of toys. I think they got a dozen toys a piece or something like that. No, uh, that it seemed like it. <laughs> Anyhow, it was a good it was a good Christmas. So, um, so then, uh, and uh, other than that, we really didn't do much in Demopolis because it, it was everything was shut down. It was just too cold to go anywhere. So, we went into town, and, you know, looked around a little bit, but there really wasn't much uh, much to do. Um, although it did look like a cute little town. So, uh, so then we got up, we uh, went through the next day after Christmas, we went through uh, the uh, Demopolis Lock there and started heading down the rivers. And we're ultimately we're headed to Mobile Bay. Uh, but to get there, we we're gonna have to anchor out overnight twice. So, um, so, uh, we'll, so the next night we were at a Anchorage in Bashy Creek. And that was really pretty cool because it's this, uh, it's kind of all overgrown, and uh, it's, you first look at it, and you go, well, you can't get a boat in there. But all the write-ups about it said you could. You just go slow, and you had to kind of dodge around a bunch of limbs and trees and stuff. Um, but it was really in there, and it was really peaceful. It was just, uh, it was, and it was actually the first time we used a stern anchor too, just to kind of hold us in the creek because we were afraid we might swing into the into one of the shores. So that was pretty cool, uh, and. Uh, yeah, so it was very like said, very peaceful at, at, at night. We couldn't do anything with the dogs because uh, it was just too cold to, to, to try to launch the dinghy and, and, and get into cold water. We weren't going to do that. So the dogs had to kind of hold it. And there really wasn't anywhere to go. Yeah, there really I mean, wasn't. we could have went exploring, I guess, and tried to find a, a spot. Right. We didn't see anything. And, yeah. You know. So we just uh, we just hung out there. Uh, and then uh, the next day we got up and we, uh, we backed out of there. We actually had to back out because there was no way we could turn the boat around so that was kind of interesting uh, and then uh, so pretty much after that we headed uh, headed on down the river so uh, we'll pick that one up in the uh, the next time so uh, anything else it was it was a fun anchor it, it was a, that was our first anchor right that no, was the second time oh, it was anchor. Second anchor. yeah okay. it's second time anchoring uh, and it's, it's like everything else it's getting uh, it's getting easier as it goes yeah. and uh, that was good it was good so cheers well, cheers It's a beautiful 